Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's the Asian Fina back with another spectacular Chinese food review. So typically on Tuesdays, I it's my arm workout day along with my jujitsu. And once I'm done with that, usually I'm very tired. Sometimes I even take a cure on a short hike. So that's when I decide to just stop at my local Chinese uh, favorite joint, that's the Jambo Cafe. And today I'm reviewing their seafood and pork wonton soup. This is $8.95 on the menu. Um, to go they separate the soup base in a plastic container and take a look at this sexiness right there you see how all these ingredients you see a one time properly wrapped up with onions on top and the caramelized onions like onions and you got some bar barbecue pork strips jalapenos and fresh lettuce you know what I'm gonna plate this real well and see how it turns out Got that egg noodle on the bottom, check it out. Oh, none of these but a drop. I'm gonna make this look real good. There you go. We got all those sexy ingredients. Gotta have the jalapeno spice spice of my life. And let's check a look at the soup base. It's still hot in the container. Oh man, it's heavy. It smells like Shrimp base with a little bit of chicken and beef in there. That's that proper stock soup base. One of the most important. But of course, wonton being the most important ingredient. Otherwise, it wouldn't be known as wonton noodle soup, right? So basically, wonton noodle soup is a traditional Chinese dish. Uh, that's very popular in the Chinese cuisine. Where you feature, uh, you know, wontons with pork and shrimp in there. So straight from their menu. Their wonton noodle soup is basically um, wonton which consists of uh, seafood and pork in there. Uh, you got the barbecue pork strips and fried egg noodles and a light fragrant broth. Alright, so what I can count is six succulent pieces of wonton properly wrapped up. Now, I remember when I worked for my parents, helped them out, I also a little bit of the wonton and crab rangoons and let me tell you typically the mixture is chopped up celery with um clear noodles well it's carrots either a combination of pork chicken and shrimp i believe and looks like they also the count of the barbecue pork is like four slices of this i love that color and texture but it could be a little bit more got some jalapenos in there and the fresh um this is romaine lettuce, I believe, and some of the, uh, this is the, what do you call this? This is chives, I believe, hanging out, and you see the egg noodle. You know what? Let's just go and dive into it. Check out the egg noodle right here, thin extra egg noodle for one time. It's got to be thin egg noodles, otherwise it wouldn't be one time noodle soup. And the thing about the noodles is it can't be too soft or too hard. Well, actually it's more, a little bit more on the hard side, but because it's thin, it's not as chewy. It's got a very nice flavor. Um, the egg noodles typically is either egg flavor or shrimp. I prefer the shrimp flavor ones. And I believe that's just the regular egg noodles. Now uh, here's the barbecue pork. And I believe these are like $8.99 pound if you buy it from a local Asian grocery store. So delicious. Mm. This the romaine lettuce. It looks pretty fresh and crunchy. Yeah, that's good stuff. Now, for the most important ingredient, is the one ton. Let's dissect it real well. Real good. The skin, I believe, is made of. Um, I could be wrong. Made of wheat. Flour, something like that. Now, as you take a close up look at it one time, do you see that piece of shrimp right there hanging out? That's the shrimp, and that's a combination, I believe, of either pork or chicken or either a combination of that. I don't really see any greens in there, so maybe they didn't put any um, vegetables in there. But it is, it's, it's delicious. I mean, it's got the right flavor to it. Um, 
not salty or anything like that. Very delicious. I need to get a spoon. Well, get the spoon. I'm just gonna sip it like this. That's how we Chinese do it, you know. Ah, oh, that broth is light and tasty. It's not like pho because pho is more like a chicken broth or beef broth. This is more like a Chinese style of um, a mixture between, you know, um, vegetables in there, beef and chicken mixture. It just tastes different and it goes perfect with the the one ton noodle soup. Overall, it's a pretty nice dish for $8.95. I just wish there was, you know, slightly more of the barbecue part maybe. And I typically, for myself, I prefer the baby bok chai or the yu choy as opposed to romaine lettuce. So on a scale of 100%, I'm going to hold this up with a 87%. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. As always, eat hard. Work out harder, baby. That's my gym shirt. Girls, since this is my dinner, I'm just going to hold you up with this barbecue pork, all right? I got to have my one ton. I got to have my protein, you know? And you're at your dinner, so that's a real nice piece of generous barbecue pork for you. What do you think of it? What do you think of it? Huh? Pretty tasty, huh?